Hello everybody. Welcome to another Trust Tabs movie review for Trust Tabs Movie Night. I just finished watching this movie, 10 Cloverfield Lane. When I when this when this movie was out, I I mean the cinemas, I avoided all trailers. I watched I think just one and then I just stopped watching any trailers. I knew I was going to like this movie and I didn't want any spoilers whatsoever. Let's face it, trailers today, well, almost always, are terrible. They give away way too much of the movie. I don't know if this is the case with this one, but I didn't want to take any chances. Yeah. As I said, I just finished watching this about 15 minutes. It's good. It's good. It's definitely good. Um, when 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 I was thinking of buying it, uh, when I decided to buy it, uh, I had in mind that this was going to be a psychological thriller taking place perhaps 100% in this um, one small space at least according to the one and only trailer I watched and I, I, I like that, I like the idea in general I like the idea of movies which take place in small places and have uh, they're based mostly on the uh, story and the dialogue and the characters interaction no matter if we are talking about comedies or thrillers or science fiction films or whatever I like that uh, keep holding this because there's nothing else to show um, as usual I'm not going to spoiler the movie because I hate spoilers in movies or books or games or stories in general I don't know uh, so I'm gonna go ahead talk a little bit about the story sticking only with what the first trailer from memory uh, showed and actually I'm not even going to say much about that either. It's a story about a small number of people in a confined space surrounded by events or possible events that are very very dangerous. We see basically something similar to what uh, zombie movies are about you know it's not about the zombies it's about the humans how they are the real monsters yeah that's bullshit but anyway uh, yeah it is par partly it is like that but it's not yeah one of the hardest things about talking about uh, a movie without sharing any spoilers is that you can't really say much about the story. All I'm about to say is if you like psychological thrillers uh, that have just a hint of uh, science fiction or mystery or thriller then this is definitely a movie to watch it's um here's the thing I have a confession to make about it for the most part there was one thing that really I, I, I just couldn't accept it I'm talking about the script which you know when you when you have seen the whole movie you understand it from a technical standpoint why this decision was made. I'm talking about the story. 
But if you don't think about it that way, then you will probably enjoy the film even more than I did. Yeah, I didn't expect that from me, did you? Yeah. Uh, so there was this technicality, this script technique, or however you want to call it, which makes absolutely good sense for a movie or a story, but still annoyed me. And I wish it was written in a different way. I wish the script had perhaps one more revision. <laughs> uh, other than that, the movie is very good. It has, it starts one of the best intros in a movie ever for me. And it's, um, has, I don't know if I should give it away. It, it's not, it's not really important story-wise. Uh, it's, it's, um, artistic technique. Uh, there's no, for the first few minutes, there's no voice, there's no sound effects, just music and action. Well, action, I mean, you know, you see something, it's not just blank screen. And that's fantastic. Uh, it helps that the music is very good. It's one of the best soundtracks in recent memory. And very good acting, even without any speed, for the first few minutes. There are not many actors in this film, but all that do so in the film are definitely doing the best and it, it, it shows. It, it, I, I'm sorry, I'm just... I, I love this film. Um, yeah, I can't say that much about the story and that is really frustrating. Go and watch it. Uh, visually, fantastic for what it is. Uh, sound effects, fantastic. Music, acting, editing, everything is just superb. Definitely, don't watch any trailers if you haven't yet. Uh, don't read any reviews unless you know they're going to be spoiler free. Just watch this film. Enjoy it. Don't, don't, don't stop and do other stuff, just watch it in one go. Not perfect, definitely not perfect, but very good. For me, a cult classic to be. Uh, I give this movie a very, very good score of seven speakers out of eight monitors. Thank you very much for watching.